And we're back with Talk of the Town. Daniel Jackson has joined us. He is a golf coach at Heritage Academy. He's been with us before, but specifically today, he's talking about a big event for the golf team. So welcome back. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me. <laughs> so how is, first of all, how is everything going with the golf team? You've got boys and girls at Heritage. Yeah, everything's going really well. The school is doing phenomenally well. It's doing a lot of good things and positive things for the students. And the golf team for both the boys and the girls is also going very well. And growing, are you getting growing. more students? Growing, boys team is growing. We're getting 12, 14 players and we're getting more and more interest. And the girls are also um, going through a growth spurt at the moment as well. So it's. It's great because everyone's realizing what the opportunities are right. being offered to them and uh, the benefits of doing it. So, and the benefits of having you as a coach. Thank, yeah, good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's talk about an event on March the 27th at the Country Club of Hilton Head. It's a big fundraiser for the students, the student athletes. All the dollars will be going to the athletes. Correct. So. It is uh, 9.30, it is a golf tournament, if you will. Yeah, effectively, yeah. it's a golf tournament, yeah. and the Country Club of Hilton Head have been really supportive, been amazing with the, the partnership that we have with them. And they've been supporting us in everything that we've wanted to do with the golfers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And on the 27th of March, we're holding a fundraiser that can hopefully generate a lot of good money that will go directly back to the students and to continue opening doors for them and opportunities. So when you say going back to the students, be more specifically, what will the dollars do? Is it for equipment? Is it? Correct, it will go back to the school for equipment, any other sports that require anything to again offer um, the experiences for the juniors, right. for the players, for the athletes, and for all of the students to give them the best opportunities. So it will go to um, excursions to certain events, okay. it will go to equipment, uh, facility usage, anything right. like that that can really develop great memories for them. Right. Yeah. All right. So if you want to be a player yeah. or if you want to be a sponsor, if you're a business, you can still get involved. So yeah, talk about that. Absolutely. So we're looking for players who want to come and support the juniors who want to have the opportunity to play the country club. It's a private club, it tends to have just for membership. Mm -hmm. So it's a great opportunity for anyone outside of that membership to come and play the course. Um, there's food that's going to be on, there'll be some fun events on, we're going to do a long drive competition for the junior golfers as well. Um, so we're looking for players mm -hmm. and we're also looking for sponsors for the event. And so a sponsor can sponsor different things, like a hole. So talk about Correct. those different levels. So we have hole sponsors, we have a range sponsor, a beverage cart sponsor, a range cart sponsor where people can hit golf balls at the the golf cart <laughs> itself. So we're trying to keep it very lighthearted, but a lot of enjoyment as well. So there's lots of different opportunities for businesses to sponsor. And if you go to the website, they'll give like, you know, how much for each, or you can just donate what you can? That's it. I would say get in contact with us um, and ask what is available at that time, because we get a lot, we're getting a lot of people that are interested in helping us out, and we want to keep on growing that and kind of drive that popularity. Right. So I would say contact us, see what we have available, and then we can keep um, growing it from there. So Daniel, there are a lot of golf tournaments. So why, why, why support this particular one? Why is this so important for our young people? Great, because it's going directly to the island golfers. It's going directly to the students on the island. And it's supporting the families that, you know, work really hard, that support their children as much as possible. And it's going above and beyond supporting, again, the people that we're trying to um, develop on the island, the character. The character. And that's Correct. what I love about Heritage Academy. It's it's more than just academics that's and right. the extracurricular. It really is building the values of the students and particularly, you know, teamwork and that's it. The, the character, individual character development. That's it. The sport itself is the vehicle. Um, but the primary focus is to develop the characters of the players, um, of the students, should I say, to give them greater opportunities as they go on towards college and go into working life and further into the field. Well, you're a great leader. Thank you're you. a great role model for the young people. It's good Thank to you. have you as their golf coach, Daniel Jackson. And again, the event is on March the 27th. Correct. Uh, 7 or 9.30 in the morning, and you can go to the website and get all the information. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. And that's it for this edition of Talk of the Town. Thank you for joining us, everyone. Thank you, Daniel, Thank you. for closing out our show. And we'll be back next time. Don't go away.